Welcome, welcome back on any help at Cisco. In this example, uh, we have a circle, and do you notice R, A, and T, A are tangent to this circle? Oh, where we need to find the measure of angle R, A, T, which is this angle. Okay, and we have a property of a tangent. A tangent is perpendicular to the radius at the point of tangency. So, in other words, this angle here and this angle here are 90 degrees angle because OR is perpendicular on RA. That's what the property says, the theorem says. And also OT, which is the other radius, is perpendicular on uh, AT or TA, which means the angle uh, R and T are right angles, so the measure of angle R is 90 degrees, and the measure of angle T is also 90 degrees. And now we can take a look in the quadrilateral O, R, A, T, that quadrilateral. The sum of these interior angles of this quadrilateral is 360 degrees. So I'm going to write the measure of angle O plus the measure of angle R plus the measure of angle A or RAT, how it's called in the problem, plus the measure of angle T equals 360. And measure of angle O is 140, angle R is 90 degrees, Angle A, I'm going to call it X, just to make the problem a little bit more algebraically. And angle T is also 90 degrees. So we have now an algebraic equation. Remember, X is nothing else than the measure of angle A or RAT. So we're going to combine the three uh, numbers we see here. 140 plus 180, that will be... Um, 320, 320 plus x equals 360, subtract 320 on both sides, and we finish the problem, x is nothing else than 40, and remember the x is nothing else than the measure of angle A, or how it's called in our problem, R-A-T, which is 40 degree. And that's it. If you enjoyed this video clip, don't forget to click the like button and come back on C-Square for more help. Thank you.